And welcome to another edition of Skin Sense. I'm your host, Janine Mazurkevich, and we are back with Dr. Schleicher. And once again, I keep getting stuck in this seat, and I see a pencil in your hand. Yes, we have so a, what, are we, uh, what are we doing today? We have a volunteer. Yeah, so right. she's not really volunteering. She's, <laughs> she's actually strapped down here. So um, Arms but, and legs are strapped in. Yeah, yeah. I think the sedative's working. So you're more, she's more I'm calm be now. So that's soon. very, very good. Um, and actually today what we're going to do is we're going to work on Janine's, she has little folds here. They're I mean, not bad at all. They're really not bad at all. Right. But we needed a volunteer and I, she was walking by the office. I said, come on in and this is what happened. This is what happened. I'm so, chained down. But the, the whole goal to some of these therapies is, is number one, to correct what you have. Okay. But number two, to try to prevent lines and wrinkles and creases from occurring. So what we're going to use today is a compound, which is actually made of calcium. We've talked about it before, mm -hmm. okay? Very commonly used, and it's used as a filler. And what it does is it immediately fills in lines and creases. And the other thing it does is it stimulates collagen. So over time, hopefully, that you will not need as much, number one, and number two, you will age less grace, less you know, dramatically mm -hmm. and more gracefully. That's the whole goal of all these therapies. Okay, and again, as we all know, it used to be to get corrections of your face, people would spend tens of thousands of dollars on face lips. Mm -hmm. We don't have to do that anymore for the right. majority of People patients. love these shows and they're so. always questioning and that's why we have them on so so much. They stop me and they ask me questions. Yeah, about as long as they're simple. I mean, yeah. my, my belief is if things are simple, that's great. A lot of the lasers we do, yeah, they're simple, but they just don't work that well and they take a lot of time and you know, a fair amount of finances to start seeing results. With this, the results are immediate. Okay, right. so what we're going to do It doesn't hurt. Is <laughs> Okay. Yeah, I haven't even done anything yet. Okay, this is a little marking pencil, so we're just gonna, I'm just gonna mark to out. Me? No, we'll mark out this side, and we'll do this side. Okay, and you know, if you look real, real close, you can see that Janine is just starting to get real, this. Real, real close. Yeah, real, real close. It's starting to get this little nasal labial fold, which everybody gets over time. Um, I'm about due for radius myself, because I'm getting And I'm gonna it. give so, it to Dr. Schleicher yeah, that, that'll be on the, the day. show. All right, as soon as you graduate medical school, that's a deal. That's All right, week. so next week, okay. Well, anyway, this, right. is, this is what we use, and again, it's called radius, and it's very, very easy to administer, and what we do is basically go in here. It does have xylocaine in it, so you'll feel a little bit of numbness, and we basically build up this area here. Now, it yeah. actually doesn't, doesn't hurt. It's real, real easy to do, okay? Right. And that is the whole point. And it's wow. really all Janine basically needs, okay? Because she's, you know, she, she's aging very well. I'm not gonna ask how old you are, but you, you know, you're probably a lot. A lot younger than you? Then, oh. uh, I, well, you're probably, you you're probably older than you act. I'm 36. Okay, so she's 36, okay? So she's like, like a third of my, my age. So I'm actually not bad for 80. All right. Well, um, but anyway, th this was you can it. Feel that, the, you can feel the numbing in your mouth, and it does. Yeah, and you can feel a little mm -hmm. numbing. And just to show you, this was not very, I didn't want to do anything dramatic, and she didn't need anything dramatic. And it's a very, very simple procedure to do. And, you know, we basically did it. And so, we're going to show a dramatic. Well, we're going to show things that are a lot more dramatic. Okay. Absolutely, absolutely. But, Janine, how was it? It was easy. It, it was, was very, easy. very easy. Okay, it doesn't hurt. No. Um, and you can see, if you can zero in, you can see, now I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do the other side. Should um, I make a, can what, you tell the difference? Of the show, and it, yeah, we can maybe go from side to side and see the difference. But it was, you know, it's a very, very simple procedure. Excellent. All right, let's Great. take a break. When yep. we come back, hopefully my face will be evened out and uh, we'll have another surprise guest on to show you another before and after. Again, we're talking about fillers and we'll answer some of your questions. And we're back, you're watching Skin Sense here on SSP TV. And I know I look younger now that I have my fill, right? 
I'm, yeah, do you course. have your fill of me here, yet, Every dog? time you see me, I'm with a syringe. <laughs> every time you see a dog, he has a needle here. in his hand. But so. uh, we wanted to show, um, we have some pictures, and uh, before we get to my mom, we wanted to show some pictures and show how exactly if you start getting the filler when you're a little bit younger, right, mm -hmm. then you can show the improvement. So do mm -hmm. you want to explain that? Yeah, well, basically what happens as we get older, we start losing tissue in our face especially, okay, and where does that tissue loss predominate? Well, in the cheeks, okay, our, our cheeks start to get sunken, okay. all right, and the folds about the nose and folds about the mouth, they become more accentuated. So, it, so basically what we're doing is we're trying to build up those areas, mm -hmm. okay, with, with a filler, and the filler that we use predominantly is made from calcium. And since everybody has calcium in their bones, it's impossible to get allergic to it. It's just, I call it liquid, it's either liquid bone or liquid calcium. Well, people will used. say, why well, get it so, when you're so young? Because there are people, the trend is now in your 20s and your 30s to get the Botox. Right, I'm sure a lot of you saw the report on 2020 of right. 16 and 17 year olds getting, you know, cosmetic procedures. Um, and the, the whole goal now is to prevent you from kind of aging to okay. some degree and you know you want to do preventative especially if it's simple preventative and right. not very expensive preventative it's you know I I think it's a great idea okay so we're gonna so, look at doing those lines yeah and we're gonna do the folds here okay and you can see um, these everybody has these folds smaller. Uh, yeah everybody has them and 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 you know over time they just become more and more accentuated and then a lot of times what we do too is we build up a little bit in in the cheek area as as well. Okay. So we'll start with the phones and basically it's it's just ba it's a little it's a little pinch and it does have no numbing medicine in it. So and again it, it's a filler. So what we're doing is we're filling up these areas. So when people come to me and they say fill her up, at, <laughs> fill her um, up you know, it's not like a gas station, all right? We're using a little different product here. And, but you can see the results are tremendous. Yes. And the results are immediate, which, which is great too. Mm -hmm. And you know, believe it or not, we have a lot of people who come in here who don't want their husbands to know, even though their husbands are probably paying for it, but they don't want to know what they're paying for. Okay, but the cool thing is, you can do it as subtle as you want, all right? You don't have to, you know, you see all the anchor women on TV with, with the, the huge lip. Well, not you, because yours are naturally huge, but you see huge lips, and, you know, they have, it's because they have fillers in their lips. Right. But some of them just abnormal amount. Right. But what we're doing, you can see, we're, we're building up this area, and it's doing very, very nicely. Now, how is it pain-wise? There's no pain. Okay. It doesn't so, hurt. Nothing. Yeah, it really, and we fan out here, so we do here. I'm just amazed that it doesn't hurt, and I would honestly tell you if it did, but it really doesn't hurt at all. Because, there. again, there's that um, yeah. medicine in there so, that helps. Yeah, there, it has xylocaine in there, which, which actually numbs it. And, and again, so. we want to emphasize that um, there can be complications if you don't go to someone who is certified and trained. Dr. Schleicher has been doing this for years. Well, the main complication you can get, if you go too superficial, you can get little lumps, mm -hmm. which not very serious. I mean, you can just kind of pound them out. But why have lumps if, you know? And the other thing is, if you use the wrong filler in the wrong area, for instance, I wouldn't use this filler in the lips because mm -hmm. that area is very, very prone to getting lumps. Mm -hmm. We use different fillers for the lips. But right. for here, it's great. And then we can put just a little bit okay. right in here. Okay. And now, you don't what does need, that do? You don't need an awful lot. It gives a fullness. Okay. okay. So we like to give a little bit of a fullness here. And sometimes what you could do, if you, sometimes you can actually build this area up so much, like a lot of people have a lot of at, uh, what, we call, uh -huh. what we call atrophy. So if you fill the, this area, believe it or not, it actually helps take out that, that crease okay. as well. 
Well, there so. are some other uses uh, for this particular filler that we're going to talk about. I'm going to let you finish off the other mm -hmm. side of yeah, my mom's face, here. and we're going to take a break. But when we come back, we're going to talk about the other uses, and you can beautify your hands as well. Stay with us. We're doing another procedure per your request here on Skin Sense. And welcome back, you're watching Skin Sense. And again, if you're just tuning in, we're talking about fillers and the appropriate ways to use the fillers to look younger. Exactly. And what we're going to do now is concentrate on the hands because similar to the face, you know, as we get older, our hands start to lose mass, okay? Tendon mass, muscle mass, and just regular skin cells that kind of support the, the undersurface uh, of our hands. Mm. And, you know, sure we can work on the face, but, you know, a lot of people, you know, are kind of self-conscious about their hands. And, you know, we'd like to build them up and we'd like to do that simply. Okay. So what we're going to do is, a again, use the filler called Radius, okay, which is liquid bone. And what we like to do is basically put a volume in, in an area of the hand, okay? We raise a little wheel. Um, the hand is very vascular, so little little pinch, and we'll raise, we'll raise basically a wheel here. Now, for all the shows we've done cosmetically, we've never done anything with the hands, and no, sometimes no, people look at your hands before they look at your face to try to guess how old you are. I have a friend like that. He looks at someone's hands, and he can guess exactly how old they are. Yeah, and what we'll do is we'll tent this up a little bit, and basically we're adding, we're ad adding volume to this area here, and then we squish it around. Um, so, and we'll do an area, say, over here. So do you go between but the, the knuckles? Well, you know, the, the, the hand is pretty vascular to some degree, so we want to kind of avoid the, the vessels as best we can. Um, and we do what's called the bolus, which is this raised area here. Okay. Um, and then what we like to do is spread that out, and we can have you go like this. And How's it feeling there? We're plumping you up today, I skinny. I don't feel anything, and... Uh... It's looking okay. good. Yeah, we like to spread this around. I mean, it may be a little swollen for a few hours to a day or so. But, you know, depending on how much you actually use, uh, again, we'll put a little over here. and We can tent up an area here. So again, no pain involved in this. No, it's, it's How long it's will something like this last? Will this, is this something that lasts well, longer hands, because it's not something where you're using nice the face if, muscles all the time? It would be nice if these fillers lasted longer, okay? But, you know, radius normally will last a, a year or so. Wow, uh, that's sometimes good though. More. I mean, for, for what um, you're getting? Yeah, yeah, um, sometimes longer. Sometimes Silly question last, to ask you. Um, I always say if you're, if you're a smoker, it's right. it's and, anything's gonna anything's gonna last. I'll actually do a little bit. Now, is it there. silly to say if you smoke that it will not last as long too on, on any part of your body? I always body? feel that it won't because okay. you know the smoking has ingredients that that basically break down okay collagen and break down okay. skin components. So, I mean, it's a great reason. To, if you're a smoker and you worry about aging, it's a real good reason to give it up. Yeah. Um, because it's worth the extra you know it's one of the main determinants of of you know wrinkles. Okay. Besides all the other bad health. So any. So of my you patients, kind of mold that together, doc. Yeah, we kind of mold it. Um, and. Does it feel different on your in your no, hand? No, it doesn't. What, no, I just have I a question. A what bit, is yeah. it? What is it made out of? What are you putting in there? This is made out of calcium, which okay. is again we call it liquid liquid bone. Um, a little bit over here. And a lot of times, we'll, we'll have somebody come back for a touch-up of right. their hands. What are some uh, of the questions while you're doing this that viewers should be asking if they want to get this procedure done as far as the information with fillers? I know we co covered some of the questions, but are, what are some, in the common ones, well, what are some main, of the other The main thing that questions? people ask um, is, you know, pricing, okay? Right. And price depends on how much you use, mm -hmm. and it depends what filler you use, okay? so. Um, to use, say, one and a half cc's, which is a big, big syringe of this, you know, it's in the $500 or so range per, per syringe. 
Um, there are other other fillers that are a lot more expensive, and they don't seem to last any longer. So mm -hmm. there's, I see no real reason to use them. Uh, but again, in the geographic areas, you know, I was doing some Florida. You know, a syringe would be two two hundred dollars more. Mm -hmm. It's the geographic area. Now, okay. you, my mom was asking so. about the uh, the calcium and what exactly the filler is made out of, and this mm -hmm. is. This is the solid form. Yeah, that's the solid. This this is the solid form of calcium. Okay, if you ground down bone or you know if you evaporate milk, well that contains calcium. Okay. okay, so that's that. But yeah, so you can see what we did with one one syringe full, uh, and yeah. And I could show you how and it looks, and it's so this is actually something that is. You're just replacing what is in what is. Yeah, actually. and that's liquefied. Okay. So, but the but the great thing is calcium is obviously harmless. You know, you don't have to worry about putting in some foreign substance. Right. I'm not going to. So that's it. We did we did real. Let's see well. the difference between uh, the two hands. Yeah, we did well, and uh, we're okay. gonna we can of course add more. Right. Um, this is just to show you how okay. easy it is. Um, you can see through, it's, just, in the, through there. it's really a function of, uh, you know, really a lot of times is how much, you know, how many syringes you put in. Mm -hmm. And, you know, it's, it, it gets expensive if you're doing, you know, lots and lots. So okay. around here, a lot of people would just rather do things gradually and, you know, you build up that way. And again, the hope is over time we'll actually stimulate collagen. Okay, your, your own body's collagen, so hopefully you'll need less over time. All right. Well, if you have any questions, you can always call us at the station or you can check us out online. I have a Facebook. It's Janine SSP TV, and that's where you can get a hold of me. You can watch the show at SSPTV.com or in the Hazelton area at Service Electric Cablevision Channel 13. Um, anything in closing? No, I, I just, again, I want everybody to be aware that this is a very, very simple procedure. It's, and safe. Yeah, it's safe. And, you know, we generally don't, you know, a lot, some practices will actually do their cosmetic procedures on a given day. Mm -hmm. But with our practice, um, if you tell the, you know, the receptionist, whatever, you want to come for the procedure, we'll accommodate you whatever day or whatever time we get you in, we'll get you in. And unlike us, how we so. do everything on television, it is in a private and comfortable setting. So if you do want to have it uh, disclosed, you can also have some privacy. Yeah, guaranteed. Usually I don't have the cameras on when I'm doing these things, okay? Unless so. you want us here. Yeah, unless if you, you absolutely, if you insist, maybe we will. If you'd like to be a guest on one of our shows, on one of our procedures, again, get me on um, Facebook at Janine SSPTV. And thanks for um, tuning in. We'll see you next time here on Skin Sense.